Hold, now before listening to this audiobook, you must have read it beforehand in order to revise effectively. And now, you can subscribe to our Instagram handle and all links given in description. To animals belonging to phylum chordae to are fundamentally characterized by the presence of a notochord, a dorsal hollow nerve cord and paired pharyngeal gill slits. Figure 4.16. These are bilaterally symmetrical, triploblastic, coelomate with organ system level of organization. They possess a postanal tail and a closed circulatory system. Table 4.1 presents a comparison of salient features of chordates and non-chordates. Phylum chordata is divided into three subphyla, urochordata or tunicata, cephalochordata and vertebrata. Subphyla urochordata and cephalochordata are often referred to as protochordates, figure 4.17, and are exclusively marine. In urochordata, notochord is present only in larval tail, while in cephalochordata, it extends from head to tail region and is persistent throughout their life. Examples, urochordata, acidia, salpa, delirium, cephalochordata, bronchiostoma, amphioxus or lancelet. The members of subphylum vertebrata possess notochord during the embryonic period. The notochord is replaced by a cartilaginous or bony vertebral column in the adult. Thus all vertebrates are chordates but all chordates are not vertebrates. Besides the basic chordate characters, vertebrates have a ventral muscular heart with two, three or four chambers, kidneys for excretion and osmogulation and paired appendages which may be fins or limbs. 4.2.11.1 Class, Cyclostomata All living members of the class Cyclostomata are ectoparasites on some fishes. They have an elongated body bearing 615 pairs of gill slits for respiration. Cyclostomes have a sucking and circular mouth without jaws, figure 4.18. Their body is devoid of scales and paired fins. Cranium and vertebral column are cartilaginous. Circulation is of closed type. Cyclostomes are marine but migrate for spawning to fresh water. After spawning, within a few days, they die. Their larvae, after metamorphosis, return to the ocean. Examples, Petromus, Lamprey, and Myxene, Hagfish. A jawless vertebrate, Petromus, 4.2.11.2 class, Chandrakthais. They are marine animals with streamlined body and have cartilaginous endoskeleton. Figure 4.19. Mouth is located ventrally. Notochord is persistent throughout life. Gill slits are separate and without operculum, gill cover. The skin is tough, containing minute placoid scales. Teeth are modified placoid scales which are backwardly directed. Their jaws are very powerful. These animals are predaceous. Due to the absence of air bladder, they have to swim constantly to avoid sinking. Heart is two-chambered, one auricle and one ventricle. Some of them have electric organs, for example, torpedo, and some possess poison sting, for example, trigon. They are cold-blooded, poikilothemous, animals, that is, they lack the capacity to regulate their body temperature. Sexes are separate. In males pelvic fins bear claspers. They have internal fertilization and many of them are viviparous. Examples. Scoliodon, dogfish, pristis, sawfish, carcharodon, great white shark, trigon, stingray, 4.2.11.3 class, ostage thighs. It includes both marine and freshwater fishes with bony endoskeleton. Their body is streamlined. Mouth is mostly terminal, figure 4.20. They have four pairs of gills which are covered by an operculum on each side. Skin is covered with cycloid. Tenoid scales. Air bladder is present which regulates buoyancy. Heart is chambered, one auricle and one ventricle. They are cold-blooded animals. Sexes are separate. Fertilization is usually external. They are mostly oviparous and development is direct. Examples, marine, ixocoitus, flying fish, hippocampus, seahorse, freshwater, labio, ruu, cattler, cattler, clarios. Mega, Aquarium, Beta, Fighting Fish, Terraphilum, Angelfish, Ford. <laughs>